We are, we're going to show you the difference between a exterior drawer and an interior drawer and how to install your track. So what you see here is your exterior drawer and this is going to be your interior drawer. That means that when this door is shut, you have a drawer that's inside of it. So when you open it, you're going to have a drawer in here also. When you're hanging your tracks, you're going to have a couple different configurations. So you've got these holes, that's going to tell you if it's an inside drawer or an outside drawer. So right here, we have our outside drawers. They're going on the first hole right here. So as you can see, you're putting the first one in and the back one. Now we've got our interior drawer. That one is going to come one back and it's going to go in the middle and it's gonna set back. So now you can see the distance, that's gonna allow that drawer front to clear the interior of the door. And then you're gonna have one in the back there. So now you can put your track on, put your interior drawer in, that's gonna allow it to clear that drawer. So that's the difference between an exterior drawer and an interior drawer and how you put the track on. Also with the interior drawer, you have to have the 153 hinges in order for the drawer to clear the door to open. So that's how you do your tracks and your drawers. Thanks for watching. All right, so here we are going to show you how to install an interior drawer in a pantry. Uh, I'm going to show you also how I like to hold the rail to not damage any drawer front and uh, secure it to the frame uh, easier. So I take it, I grab, I extend the front out, I'll hold it like this, I'll let it go down so it slides on my hand. It doesn't go down this way or else it'll fall out. So I'll hold it like this. Take my screw gun, my screw. I'm gonna be on the interior bracket. So this is the exterior, interior is here. So I put it in here and now I have complete control of my screw. I'm ready to put this track on my pantry. So I'm gonna go at this height. And now because I have complete control, I was able to tighten it, move my hole down, line that up. I can let it go. And now I can just take my next screw and put that in. And now your track is installed. So now you just match the next side and you've installed your interior drawer. One, two, three, four, five up. I'm gonna count one, two, three, four, five up. That's my hole. Take it, set it about halfway back on the track, set your drawer down, push it in with a snap, and your drawer is on. And you're good with interior drawers at this point to go ahead and just close these up and you're finished off with your cabinet. Interior drawer front. Thanks for watching guys.